Bostic, and I'm a physiotherapist here to discuss certain injuries that can happen with younger kids in basketball. Uh, one of them in particular is patellofemoral syndrome, which is discussed in the kneecap sitting into a groove in between the femur and the tibia. So the kneecap sits in that spot and every time you bend your knee, it moves up and down. However, if certain muscles are weaker, certain muscles that hold your kneecap in place, the kneecap can come out to the side. And what that will cause is pain around the kneecap, which a lot of kids complain about. And this, in fact, is actually coming from a weaker hip. And the reason the hip is weak is because we move front and back and not side to side. And I'm going to show you a couple exercises today that can help your child in terms of strengthening their hip. Okay, so one thing we want to look at with kids is whether or not their arch is maintained or whether they have a collapsed arch. And what you can see here is he's got a flat foot. And that's common in most kids. And what that does is it affects the alignment of the knee, keeping the knee over the top of the toe. And from above, the other thing we want to look at is whether or not they got a stronger hip. So one thing we look at with that is we get you standing on one foot and you're going to bend the knee down and you can look at uh, how the knee is in terms of whether it stays over the toe. So let's try that again. Bend the knee. You can see he collapses down at the knee. If it's working ideally, you should be able to go knee over toe just like this, no problem. But when you're collapsing inwards, what it makes the knee want to do is come out to the side. And from below, when you have your feet flat, caving in, it makes your kneecap want to come out to the side. So when they bend the knee, you start to get grinding in the knee, and that's where the complaint of knee pain happens with the younger kids. Okay, so another way to confirm a weak hip is you can also test the actual strength of the hip. So one way to do that is have them lying on their side, bend both knees, straighten the top leg, make sure they don't fall back at the hip, hold that there, don't let me move it, hold, and they resist and you push down. And you see it didn't take much for me to do that at all. That's an indication of a weak hip.